Good evening. An IT disruption linked to the Texas-based global cybersecurity firm CrowdStrike caused outages and major disruptions for airlines, banks, media companies, and telecommunications firms across the globe that use Microsoft computer systems. Michael Anholt shares how the outage has impacted travel at the Bismarck Airport. Since 5 a.m. Friday morning, travelers have been facing the burden of delayed and canceled flights. Delta and United have experienced delays ranging from two to four hours. There could be ground holds, you know, going into hubs and, and then, of course, the turnaround coming back. Arrivals and departures will likely be delayed uh, the rest of the day could be even into tomo to tomorrow or the next day. Allegiant travelers planning a trip to Arizona today received news that their flight, along with all other Allegiant flights set to take off prior to 1 p.m., were canceled. Oh, we got a little upset because, you know, we had a fam uh, family trip planned back in Arizona, and then we got here and they tell us uh, everything is canceled. Dominguez was also unable to rent a car from the airport. And we're trying to look for a way to, you know, drive back home, you know. About 28 hour drive, we're trying to get our car rental. They tell us they don't have anything for us to rent unless it's just local. In a post on X, formerly Twitter, CrowdStrike CEO stated that the outage was caused by an issue with a software update and was not a cyber attack. The Information Technology Department at KFYR TV says we are susceptible to these kinds of events when operating systems around the country and the world are interconnected and protected by the same software. Major airlines across the country are still experiencing disruptions and travelers are expected to still experience delays. In Bismarck, I'm Mike Lanholt reporting for your news leader.